What's going on YouTube man welcome back to another video now before we jump into today's video man you should have know what you should have been did man like comment and subscribe we're trying to save the world we're trying to save as many people as we can so make sure you hit that post notification bell so you don't get that post not clarity my god now listen today I have a special reaction for y'all you know because I know a lot of y'all might like this video you know so I said why not why not you know so I got she telling the truth woman breaks down the five non-negotiable traits a man looks for in a wife so I want y'all to become I want y'all to be interactive as possible down below in the comment section what's she reaching or is she preaching man you know I want to know y'all opinions of this video man because you know on my channel we talk about looking for a wife getting a wife you know and the, the right type of female to allow into your life so you know let's see if she's on point with this one man so five non-negotiables all men want in a wife is this true or not let's get it man let's go all right queens you guys have been asking for this one five traits that all men want in their woman here we go number one physical attraction if you want to know one thing about men it's this they are absolutely visual creatures i cannot stress that enough a man okay physical attraction i'll give her that one that is true because we don't want no 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 four out here let's be real bro let's be real i don't care what nobody be like oh it's about the inside like now nah, looks at least for me looks matter looks matter bro you know, looks matter. In my of quality opinion. is going to want a woman who takes pride in her physical appearance. She doesn't necessarily have to be the most beautiful woman in the room, but she is going to be a woman that understands the importance of how she. And it's not even just looks, you know, it's about like, is she in, in shape? You know, is she going to the gym, working out, stuff like that? Is she taking care of her body? It's not just looks, bros. Presents herself to the world. Number two cooperation and this one is so simple if you want a man that's a natural leader you're going to have to know how to cooperate he's going Facts. to want to see if you can be a partner if you can be a team player he's not going to we do not need no headaches out here brothers you know bro she's two for two man two for two i want to fight with you over every single little thing if you are stubborn combative close-minded and negative a man of quality is going to find that extremely unattractive bro. a lot of us women get Facts. Oh my god, bro. Hold on, let me rewind that for the people in the back. Every single little thing. If you are stubborn, combative, closed minded, and. Stubborn, combative, closed minded, closed minded. Man, that's one thing I find unattractive, brother. Negative, a man of quality is going to find that extremely unattractive. A lot of us women get into the bad habit of making everything a battle. And if you want a man who is high quality, he is going to have way bigger things on his mind, like running your family in the right direction. He's not going to want to argue with you over what you are going to have for dinner. Number three, <laughs> to feel wanted. Yeah. Don't get me wrong. He wants you to be fully yoked. He wants you to have a life. He wants you to have all of those things. And you can be independent. You can be a boss woman. But just make sure that you're operating in that feminine energy that yeah. makes a man feel wanted. He's... I don't know about y'all brothers, but I, I be wanting to feel wanted, bro, in a relationship, you know. I guess my love language is um, words of affirmation. You know, comment down below what's your love language, but, you know, I want I want my women to, to give me some words of affirmation from time to time, make me feel wanted. You know what I'm saying? There's nothing wrong with that, bro. He's going to love the fact that you have passions and interests in a life outside of him. But you have to remember that a man's natural state is to be a provider and to be a protector. And he's going to want a woman that makes him feel like he has room to do that in her life. Number four, and y'all are not going to like this one. Accountability. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Harsh truth. We don't have any problem telling a man the 152 ways that they are wrong. But when the tables turn and it's our turn to be accountable, a high quality man is going to want to see that you know how to do that. Can you apologize? Can you hold yourself accountable? For some reason, for us women, it's so hard to acknowledge when we're wrong and to say that we're sorry. But a high quality man is going to want to see that you can do that. It goes back to being a good partner. 
And number five, last but not least. Man, that, that one was very important, man, because a lot of women nowadays do not like to take accountability. A lot of them don't. You know, they like to justify why they do certain things when they know it's not even right to be doing those things. You know, they don't like to, to take responsibility for their actions. You know, they think, oh, because I'm a woman, I can just do certain things. Like br brothers, man. East, I hint at this one all the time, so I'm going to speak on it now. Feminine energy. I know for some reason, whenever people talk about me. She, she got it, man. She got it. She got it. She got it. Masculine energy versus feminine energy, it gets so controversial, and I really don't understand why that is. It's honestly very simple. Your grace, your class, your poise, your confidence, your nurturing, compassionate energy. If he's really looking for a wife, he's going to want to see a woman who can bring the qualities to the relationship that he naturally as a man cannot. Now here's the thing, and this message goes to men and women. It is not fair to go out into the dating market with a full list of all of the things that you need in a partner when you don't really know the first thing about what your partner is going to need from you. Relation she, she has a point, Rose. She has a point. Relationships are a two-way street. And if you want to find and build a relationship that lasts the test of time, you're going to have to care about your partner's happiness and their needs. Word, it's not just you, man. It's not just you. You know, it's, it's, it, may, it takes two to be in a relationship. You know what I'm saying? It's not just your needs. You know, it, you can't be a narcissist. You can't be one-sided in a relationship, brothers. It's two ways, man. You want you, want you a feminine woman, so you got to be that masculine man. You know what I'm saying? Women out there, you want you a, a, a masculine man, you got to play your role as a feminine woman. You know, it goes hand to hand, bro. Just as much as your own. Hey, man, comment down below y'all thoughts and opinions, man. I really want to hear what y'all got to say about this one. You know what I'm saying? What's she reaching? What's she preaching? What's she stating some facts? Because I think she, she went five for five, man. You know, one thing she could have added was, you know... A non-negotiable for me is she got to have God in her life, man. She got to have God in her life because if you, you can't build a relationship if, if God isn't the foundation of that relationship, bro. You know, or else it's just not going to work. It's not going to last, you know. So I guess that's my non-negotiable. Comment down below your non-negotiable. Non, 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 non All right. <laughs> so like, comment, and subscribe if you're new, man. Share the video with a friend. And listen, man, I'll catch you in the next one, and I'm out. <laughs>